strength if you can move strength. Yes, God. Amen. Mm -hmm. ah, Lord, have yes, mercy. Sir. You're working it, Pastor. Thank you, Lord. I, now, I was wounded. Yes, sir. I was wounded, yes, church. Yes, sir. Uh -huh. I ain't talking about you. Yeah, I was wounded. Yeah. I was wounded, Miss Charlotte. I need to know. Has anybody in here ever been wounded? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yeah. Have you ever been wounded? Have you ever saw yourself going to a place? Yes, sir. And all of a sudden, that wound slow you down. Let well, me yeah. tell you something. I'm almost cold already. That's right. I ain't uh, preaching the whole day. Huh? Yeah. Come on. Yeah. But let me tell you. There are secrets to a wound. Yeah. Uh -huh. Teacher, help us, man. There are secrets. See, because everybody focuses on the cut uh -huh. and how deep uh -huh. the wound is. Uh -huh. yeah. uh, let me tell you, somebody said, tell me the secret. Tell, tell me the secret, secret right? What is the secret to a wound? What, 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 what? The secret is every wound, uh -huh. every wound has a testimony. Uh -huh. Amen. Uh -huh. Amen. Uh -huh. Look out, boy. Every wound has, has a story. Yes, yeah. Boy, I got a book. <laughs> Every wound yes, has a lesson to teach. Yes, I can tell you about some things that may have happened to me. Uh, and I can make it as far-fetched as I want to make it to the place that you may not even want to believe it. Uh, and you be, may be on the edge of believing what I'm telling you, but when I show you my wound, come on, yeah. it validates Ooh. me. Yeah. I can tell you how hurt I am, yeah. but my wound lets me know. All right. All right. Uh, it lets you know that it messed up my character. Yeah. Some of us got scars on our come face. On Wait, come on now. to deal with this text. Go ahead, Pastor. Uh, just, uh, go ahead. Boom. Boom. I, I, I can remember. Let me, let me teach you something about boom. I'm on my wrist right here. There's a uh -huh. burn mark there. I don't know if you can see it, but it's a burn mark there. Uh -huh. And I got it from you ever seen you're cooking on the stove, uh -huh. and I got the handle on the back side, and I had to try to go around the pot to get the, the, hand the hammer. Yeah. Should have burned myself. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you, Lord. Probably won't say. See it, some I won't post. Thank you, Lord. Some of you, you burn yourself, you gonna say the same word. Come on, Pastor. Come on, Pastor. And you is say. <laughs> I said it real fast. As I was drawing it back, I said, Now you can think of that word if you said this fast. You know what that word is. Don't act like y'all know what that word is. I burnt myself. Oh, man. I'm going to tell you something. What I did was. What you do, man? The next time I put the, the, the pot on the back, uh -huh. I make sure that hammer points yeah. true. Yeah. Uh -huh. Watch this. What happened? Because my wound, uh -huh. my wound has taught me yeah. how to move. Some of you can't get hurt the way you got hurt before. Yeah. Because you know where to go.
a testimony. Yes, sir. And the evidence of the wound is called a scar. Yeah. Yes, sir. Lord, <laughs> look at your neighbor and say, neighbor. Neighbor, I thank God. I thank God that my wounds, that my wounds have turned the scars. Have turned the scars. Yeah. Hallelujah. God has allowed me to be here. Listen, this man. Let me deal with this man. This man. This man that was left for dead. Uh huh. Wounded. He was, he was wounded, and his, his pastor did not help him. And, but he walked on the other side of the street and the deacon and the trustee looked at him and looked him up and down and saw how he was hurt. Oh, yeah. Then walked on the other, the other side. side of the street. Uh -huh. What happens when the people that are supposed to be a help yeah. oh, Come on now. that you look up to yeah. uh -huh. that you care about Oh yeah. And they do not help you. What what, Come what on happens? Now. What, what what happens is it's like them taking their finger and pressing it in your wound. Yeah. See, see, see you gotta watch for that, that, right. that you think that's on your side. Yeah. Right. Come but on then now. when you cut, they try to cut you more Come on now. instead of help heal yes. Yes. you. Yes. This is why we cannot be a church that cut. That's right. We have to be a church that learn how to bandage right. folk up. Yeah. They come from ministries. These people, uh, uh, they come from ministries that focus on the sword and not the sheep. Lord, I need to Come on now. See, come on. See, 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 see. Ministries nowadays are focusing on swords. Yeah. Focusing on the power. Yeah. But not focusing on the protection. Yeah. All right. All right. What you need to learn is protection is just as powerful as or more powerful than the sword. Yeah. Because I ain't going nowhere. Yeah. Instead of stabbing all the time, you need to be trying to protect. Right. That's right. Yeah. Giving them a chance to heal so yeah. they can fight again. Yeah. But instead, you just want to swing your Come on now. Keep cutting. Keep cutting. What's wrong? Uh, ministries. Ministries need to change. I, I asked my wife I, I was, as I was studying this thing. I'm going to start some of this, church. Uh -huh. That's right. <laughs> Call Operation Shield and Operation Sword. Where we have a, a, a group of people that focus on getting the word out. Yeah. Focus on, on, on getting people to come into church. But then Operation Shield is going to be another group of people that focus on protecting the people. Yeah. Once I get you in here, I got to learn how to shield you now. Yeah. That's right. I gotta let you get bandaged up real good so you can work. But because watch this, I'm gonna tell you, both sword and shield are effective. Yeah. Amen. And every church needs both. Both. Amen. Now those that have only swords, guess what? They don't got a lot of people. Come on now. Cause they thought that you're your ring. I know that's right. Your makeup, your pants. That's right. They try. That's right. Yeah. Yeah, that's, right. that's right. They'll cut you. Yes, They'll cut you. Uh -huh. They're coming at you. They'll cut you. But then there's another ministry uh -huh. that will grow but have no structure. Uh -huh. The one with the shield. You know why? Because they'll just love you, love you, love you. Amen. But they'll let you do whatever you want to do. Yes. Yes. Amen. That's right. Y'all ain't trying to talk that's back to right. you. Ministry have to be both. Right. Sometimes they gotta poke you to get yourself together. Yeah. 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 But then sometimes they gotta lick your wounds yeah. to right. make you stay sweet. That's right. Yeah. yeah. Mine. That's right. I'm talking this thing. Let me, let me deal with this thing. <coughs> then verse 33, the Bible speaks of this average Samaritan. Had some of 
You should have died for a minute. Uh -huh. Sure. But it speaks of this man now. He's walking by this young man. 